one less integral one. The rather very basic uh, basic technique of integration here uh, we are using completing the square. Right? So this one is equal to from, one, uh, from two to three the uh, x this will be you just break up the brackets this is minus 6 plus 5x and uh, minus x squared then then I try to complete in the square from 2 to 3 Now uh, everybody has uh, their own. Everybody has his own way to complete the square. Okay. Well, this. Well, I'm using this minus six. This. These two terms. These two terms decide that is a five over two minus x square. Right. This is coming from. Uh, these two, these two terms. This is this. Then I have to balance it because this one has a negative 25 over 4. So I have a plus 25 over 4. So this is equal to 2 to the 3 dx. And then this is a, this is a 24 over 4. So become a one quarter minus minus sorry minus five over two minus x squared. Okay, that is completely the square. Now then uh, I'm using the formula. The formula is this, the basic formula, right? D x1 minus x squared that is x sine x this is a basic formula so I want to have a 1 here so how to get a 1 here I I take uh, 1, 2, 3 dx I, I need a 1 here so I take 1 chord out after the square root becomes one half. Is that it? Yeah. Now this is one. Yeah, this is what I want. And but here now I will I will need two square, right? To have cancel this one. If square, yeah, okay. In techniques of integration, you know, maintaining equal sign is very important. How to maintain an equal sign? It has to be equal, right? So this one equal to two. Now this will become two, right? Three. And uh, this is 1 minus, this one goes inside the bracket, becomes 2. So it becomes 5 minus 2x squared. Now, then, see the formula is uh, actually is d star 1 minus star square that is the formula is octangent star right star could be single variable or even function now here my star is 5 minus 2x therefore i have to change the x into d 5 minus 2x but i have to maintain an equal sign 
This one is negative 2 dx. I have dx only, therefore I multiply by negative half. She always uh, maintaining equal sign and uh, make adjustment in order to to keep that equal sign is there. Then I can use the formula. This one is cancel out. It's negative, right? Negative one actually. This is the formula x sign five minus two x from two to three. Yeah, that is good. So this is x sign negative one plus x sine one. So this one is equal to half power. This is half power. Yeah, the answer is one. Very good. Thank you.